Hey, Hilti fans, welcome to this next episode of Hilti Live. My name is Krista Wellman, and today I'll be your digital account manager. If you haven't seen any of our previous episodes, you can check those out on our YouTube channel or our Facebook page. And if there's any products or applications that you want us to talk about, please put them in the chat. I would love to know what you guys want to see. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started in this episode. I would like to introduce uh, my teammate, Ed Sells, who is our product manager for Diamond applications, Diamond products. Great. Thanks, Krista. Yeah, thank you for being here. So we're going to be talking about our cutoff saw, um, our cutoff saw tools. Um, let's start with what we have currently, and then we can kind of dive into what is coming. Sure. So in January, we introduced our DSH 622 neuron battery powered cutoff saw at the World of Concrete. Uh, we officially launched in March, uh, and we are really excited about this particular product. Uh, one, because it really demonstrates and highlights what Neuron's all about, right? Yeah. So uh, with Neuron, we, we say all on one platform and we really mean all on one platform. Truly so mean it. <laughs> we truly mean it. So uh, cutoff saws are traditionally gas powered, right? Yes. Either two cycle or four cycle, mostly two cycle, um, but you really need that combustible engine for these demanding applications. Yeah. And with Neuron and the power we get out of our batteries, mm -hmm. we're able to power a traditionally gas powered tool or application in our neuron platform on our 22 volt platform. Awesome. So let's dive into what is coming next. So this has um, been on the, the market for about six months. Um, and let's talk about the new product. Sure, absolutely. So we're really excited to continue our innovation and bring our DSH 722. So we now have a portfolio of cutoff saws that run on our 22 volt platform, our neuron platform. And we now have not only a top handled saw, but a rear handled saw. So that's really the unique feature of the DSH 722 yeah. is our rear handle. So you may ask why top, why, why rear handle, why yeah. top handle? And it really depends on the contractor and the application that they're performing. So yeah. a top handled saw works really well when I'm cutting at waist height. Yeah. Maybe I'm cutting on a wall. Uh, maybe I need to get into some uh, uh, tight spaces. Mm -hmm. That top handle is very easy to maneuver. But when I'm cutting flat work or I'm cutting on concrete or I'm cutting rebar, I'm in a downward orientation and that puts a lot of stress on the wrist. So the rear handle actually allows me to comfortably cut mm -hmm. downward yeah. uh, on, on concrete. Yeah. The other thing we've done with the 722 is we've given you the option to integrate a wheel set to the saw. So it allows you to be able to let the, the yes. weight of the tool perform the work. Yeah, very I, productive. And when I talk about weight, What's really, really cool about both the 600 and 722 is they weigh about the same or a little bit less with mm. either sets of batteries as a fully fueled gas saw with a blade on it. So awesome. really no increase in weight. Awesome. Um, and so what makes this a real system? Yeah, sure. That's a great question. So there's really three components to this system. One is our neuron battery technology. So mm -hmm. With the saw, it runs on two of either our B22170 batteries yep. or two of our B22255 batteries. Nice. So which batteries do you select? Mm -hmm. Well, the, the 170s actually give you a lighter weight. So mm -hmm. if, if performance and handling is important, the 170 is a great option. If you need runtime or you have a very demanding application, our 255s are a great option. Okay. So what does runtime look like? Yeah. Right. Well, everybody knows that a tank of gas, what that looks like when you're cutting on a job site. Exactly. So we always sell either our 600 or this all new 722 tool with two sets of our 170 batteries or two sets of our 255 batteries. With our 170s, this will give you uh, about the same cutting uh, reach as a tank of gas. So okay. two sets of these equals a tank of gas. Two sets of our 255 batteries actually gives you 20 to 30% more cutting. Wow, that's awesome. Um, so let's, we've talked a lot about some of the great features. Let's demo. Before we demo the yeah. last part of the system that I, I was going to forget, but oh I my can't gosh. forget yes. because it's probably the most important part of the system for sure is we talked about the batteries. We talked about the tool itself. It's our insert or our blades. Mm -hmm. So we have optimized inserts for our battery yes. saw. And what that does is it allows you to achieve that full tank of gas or yeah. actually 20 to 30% more than a tank of gas. Yeah. So we have a, a universal diamond blade for cutting concrete. Uh, we have a, a, a metal cutting blade. Uh, and then we also have our traditional abrasive blade uh, for cutting metal. And all these blades are optimized to work with our battery cutoff tool. Yeah, we really have you covered from the battery to the blade. So Absolutely. awesome. Um, so let's demo now. 
Absolutely. Should you demo or should I? I'm going to demo. Awesome. So uh, we will get this all ready to cut. I've already got the blade on it. So I'm going to go okay. ahead and grab our 170 batteries. Again, two batteries, power the tool. Okay. And one of the nice features that we've built into the saw, Krista, is you're going to transport this tool over to the, the work area. Mm -hmm. We've built in a, a trigger lock here. So I've got it in a lock position right now. Okay. And that makes sure that if you were to grab the, the tool itself, uh, the, the on switch, that it doesn't actually turn on. Yeah. So it's safe to transport. When you're ready to cut, just flip that forward and you're ready to go. Okay. Sound good? What a great feature. Wow, that was really easy. And I can definitely see how that back handle is, is more comfortable for the wrist and even your back. Absolutely. You were really cutting with confidence and you showed really great techniques. Yeah. So when you're using a battery tool like this, it's, it's really important to use proper techniques. So mm -hmm. you really let the weight of the tool yeah. and a gentle rocking motion helps you perform that, that cut very quickly. Yeah, it was super easy to cut right through that. So um, awesome. What are some other safety features on this? Well, one of the things you guys might have noticed is we're actually cutting indoors today. So with yes. our battery cutoff saw, uh, you can cut both indoor and outdoor. And that's because we eliminate the combustible engine. Yeah. So if I was to cut indoors, I would have to have it ventilated or I'd have to make special accommodations to cut indoors. But with this tool, yeah. I don't have to worry about any of that, right? The other thing that's really nice about this tool is that I, I don't really have any of the traditional gas maintenance. So I don't have to worry about uh, gas. I don't have to worry about premix. I don't have to worry about pistons, spark plugs, pull cords, and the list goes on and on. Right. So really this tool is, is worry-free, charge your batteries, pop them in, go to work. Makes you way more productive on the job site not having to worry about any of that stuff. Absolutely. So. Awesome. So we've cut through some rebar. Let's cut through some concrete. Awesome. Let's do it. So before we cut concrete, I do want to share with you a new product that we launched in August, our DWP 1522 water pump. So this is a 15 liter or nearly four gallon water pump. It's powered, as you might guess, on our Neuron battery platform. So we're running it on one of our B22 255 batteries here. Of course, you can pop any Neuron battery in there. And what this product does is it allows us to supply a water source where I may not have easy access. So yeah. if I'm on a job site and I need access to water, I can grab my DWP and I've got that water that I need to perform an application yeah. like cutting concrete or even maybe diamond coring. Yeah, you're ready to go with that. I am. So I'm going to go ahead and turn it on. We've already got water flowing to the saw. I'm going to unlock our trigger. We're ready to cut. Like you, you, you used that before, you had the technique and you even showed the, the using the wheels and how easy that was. Absolutely. Awesome. So is there any other um, features or comments that you want to make about the DSH 700? Yeah, look, we're really excited about Neuron. I hope you see that we're all in on Neuron and our 22 volt platform. In just a short amount of time, we bring another addition to our portfolio, yeah. the, the rear handle DSH 722. Yeah. It's amazing to think that just six months ago, we came out with the DSH 600 and now we continue that innovation with the DSH 700. So very cool. Good job to you and your team. Thank you very much. Awesome. Well, if you guys have any questions, please drop them in the chat um, or reach out to your local account manager. Thank you so much for your time today, Ed. It was great having you and hope to see you guys next time at Hilti Live. Bye guys. Bye.